Well, hello and welcome to I Love Gay Today. And we are here with Sam Barreto at Barcelona, Spain. How are you doing, Sam? Hi, Matt. Thank you for having me. Well, we just met recently. And uh, as I've come to know you over, over time, I would almost call you like an influencer on behalf of your clients. But, uh, <laughs> but essentially, that's, that's, that's what you do, right? You're a, you're a social media marketing uh, professional and strategist. Yeah, Matt. So as you know, when it comes to social media marketing and digital marketing, there are so many tactics and strategies that you can implement. Yeah. Influencer marketing is becoming even bigger. Uh, it's a huge trend these days. And a lot of companies don't really know how to implement it or how to do it or how to approach it even. Yeah. Uh, so one of my services is to find these influencers, filter them, make sure they make sense. The different campaigns that my clients want, talk to them, negotiate, and then launch the campaigns yeah. among other organic and paid services. Yeah. I love that. But I mean, you have a, a true benefit because, you know, very, obviously very bilingual, uh, but you're not necessarily just even culturally, you can see it, you'll be able to have an advantage to see other ways of uh, looking at things. You're not from Spain, you're from Colombia. Yes, Matt. So like you said, I've had this advantage to me that even though <laughs> I fully understand like the Latin American consumer, I understand the American consumer. Yes. And I've been in Spain for almost four years. So I'm I have a pretty good understanding of the Spanish consumer. Yeah. Yeah. Because you've been in the, you lived in the U.S. as well. I did. I lived in the U.S. for 12 years. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Mm -hmm. well, that's and in the Midwest. So the <laughs> deep U.S. Yeah. <laughs> wow. And, uh, but so some of the work you're doing, you're working with uh, uh, two, uh, the uh, two that we were talking about, the mm -hmm. Colombian LGBT chamber with Felipe. That's a shout out for Felipe. <laughs> and then um, also for GayTravel.com. Tell us a little bit about each one of those. Yeah, Matt. So basically, uh, yeah, they're both my clients uh, with the Colombian LGBT Chamber of Commerce. Uh, I assist them with all things social media, all things email marketing with their different events. They actually have a pretty cool campaign going on right now for uh, Pride Month. Yeah. So go check that out. And it's for Gay Travel, oh, go ahead. Sorry. It was Virtual Pride, yes? For Virtual Pride is for GayTravel.com. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, so that's my other big client. So yeah, for yeah. Gate Travel, I just became their social media manager. And what we're doing with them is basically Gate Travel is letting all the pride organizations from across the states, they're, they're letting them basically borrow their social media audience uh, and presence to reach a greater audience for free. So we're inviting all pride organizations to just promote what they're doing, their efforts, initiatives, funding, whatever it is they're doing uh, as a result of the pandemic and not have being able to do the pride parades. Yeah. So that's basically what we're doing this month. Yeah. Wow. And so that's uh, when is that by the way? Yeah, that's going to be happening on June 28th through, okay. through the gay travel Twitter. We're yeah. just finishing the details. So keep an eye out on our social media. <laughs> that's always, <laughs> that's how we met. And that's always the best place just to, uh, to keep up. And I know, I know we're, uh, we're very, we're very focused on Twitter and that's, uh, mm -hmm. and so that's, that's going to be our first go-to that we, uh, that we check that out. Great, well, yeah. No, that's fantastic. Any other, uh, any other thoughts or anything you wanted to uh, tell, let our folks know? Yeah, for sure. Well, mainly, you know, for this virtual prep, we're also bringing along a lot of influencers to help us uh, yeah, yeah. increase the awareness of it and the reach for it. Okay. So yeah, if you have, if you know any pride or anyone knows any pride that wants to promote an initiative, you can have them reach out to us because we would love to help you reach a greater audience and share your message. Yeah, yeah. Because right now the. Uh, only one I've seen that's going global in that sense is called Global Pride 2020. And I mm -hmm. know they're, uh, uh, with, they're teamed up with like NYC Pride and a few others, but there's just a lot going on and everybody had to really pivot and make some quick changes for, the, for June. Yeah, we all did. Yeah, you're yeah. right. So that's exactly what we're doing is to give that opportunity to those, mainly those smaller prides. I mean, we, yeah. we're partnering up with bigger ones, but yeah. we also want to give a voice to the smaller ones. Yeah. Oh, nice to know you guys are doing that. Well, this is fantastic. And we'll make sure that in everything we post, we'll have the links and the Twitter, Instagram profiles and all that good stuff so that they can find you quickly and easily. Great. Thank you so much, Matt. But yeah, no, thanks for being here with us. Thanks so much for having me.